Hello. Hi everyone. So, um just a update about my day today. It's Friday. Is it Friday? Friday ba? <laughs> um no, I think it's Saturday. Oh, Friday. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> so, it's Friday today. So, I have a study day in the morning until 5 o'clock and then after the study day, I went to the range to buy some stuff. Um, I didn't buy the the lights that one because I was setting up my I was setting up my workstation my painting workstation so at last I did um, I had my phone on and I have music on but I can't really play it loud because of the copyright issues mm, my my gimbal is a bit shaky <laughs> So I just want to show you guys the my workstation and I'm just gonna put my um, iPad there so because so, so, I'm gonna do a commission not a commission but a, a practice one so yeah <laughs> I have more comfortable speaking Tagalog, but since somebody asked me to speak in English, I'll try my best <laughs> to speak in English. So, I think I, I don't know how to do it. Wait long. Um, yeah. Because <laughs> this uh, Osmo is new and not really used to it. So, and it's <laughs> Yeah, it's difficult, but yeah, it's fine get used to it person so here's my workstation i want to show you from the problem is it the osmo is focusing in my face so kakaligo ko lang yun ba my hair is still wet i want to show you but the problem is it's focusing on my face um how would i do it like this mm, no doesn't work anyway i'll figure it out later i'm just gonna i'm gonna show you that one later so, ganito. Yeah. Oh. Ah, was shocking. Okay. Here. There you go. It's a small, it's a small, um, small working station. I have my, um, my things there and at the, at the bottom of the table as well. Yeah, I don't know how to fix this gimbal yet, but I'll try to find out. So, this is my workstation, and yeah, let's let's put it here. <laughs> there you go. Um, I'm gonna practice in this bag to paint before I will actually paint in the Louis Vuitton bag. I'll just try first before I'm gonna go for. Louis Vuitton because it's a luxury product and I don't want to ruin it. Um, I'm not gonna talk while I'm doing my my painting so I can concentrate. I used to like to listen to music while I'm painting. So that's what I will do but I will give you a, a time lapse I guess. A yeah, time lapse of my painting. Ah, uh, I'm trying to hello because <laughs> I'm not used with this uh, this gimbal oh okay he said that the phone is unbalanced so I need to like you know uh, I don't know where really to put this like here this side is it did he say the phone is unbalanced I think that's it. Is it better? I don't think it's balanced though, but so I will show you how I I used to work with bags before and t shirts, um, shoes as well. But I didn't really proceed it because um I'm ke I'm not really keen of it. Um so I did work more on canvas, um, more on abstract and landscape i'm not really a professional painter but this is my like my hobby at first but when i was in um 
and there's an overview. When I was little, I used to like just, you know, sketch everywhere in my notebook and my mom was like, oh, why did you, <laughs> why did you finish all your notebooks in just a week? You're supposed to be for one semester like that. <laughs> so then when I was in high school, I always enter some of, you know, um, not a competition because I don't really go to a lot of art classes before. I mean, I mean, I'm not, I didn't really go to a formal art class. Um, I'm more on sporty one, so I do more on sports and dance, dance and other activities at school, but not really with art. But in some of our, um, some of our, like, uh, um, subjects are based on art, so I get to, to you know, to to do my artworks, and then they're telling um, the teachers like, oh, you have a talent of painting or drawing something but I'm not really I don't really like to paint that much when I was in high school but when I was in college I have a friend who was working in a gallery and he told me that I can display some of my paintings there from there I used to work with I started with an acrylic no I started with a charcoal but it's just I don't like sketching faces so I I didn't proceed to sketch um, the portrait. Um, I can do a bit of portrait when I use an oil or acrylic, but it's just time consuming. Um, I'm, I'm really busy with my main work, which is nursing, so I don't really have time to do it for like, sometimes it takes me like around a month, weeks or month before actually finishing a portrait. I did some, but I didn't really like it because of the time consuming so I had a lot of um, acrylic ones landscapes and mostly abstracts so um, yeah I, I started commissioning before when I was in in college with my classmates <laughs> eventually <laughs> it's like the Looney Tunes before is so popular like and they will ask me to do them a like a Tasmanian devil and Bugs Bunny but you know the life size so I was doing it in a tarpaulin so imagine I was doing it in a tarpaulin and then I'm using the acrylic one and when I graduated I was so busy with nursing I also did some commission works while I was working because especially when pandemic hits there's a lot of commission that time so almost of the nurses are ordering and even with the clinics in Kuwait um, I have a lot of artworks in mostly of clinics there because <laughs> I'm not really um, I'm not really you know commissioning a large money i'm just like okay you can buy me things and then i will i will do i'll do an artwork for you for your house or like that so i don't really they don't really pay for my my the talent fee because <laughs> it's some kind of a, a pastime for me there since um especially when the pandemic hits because i don't really have that nothing to do it's just work at home and you cannot go anywhere because if there's a, um, a curfew and when I went home in Philippines for about a year so I I had a full-time uh, full-time painting but unfortunately my hands were <laughs> were stiff I felt like it's gonna have a carpal tunnel syndrome already. so I stopped because that time I was working from um, like 7 a.m. until sometimes 5 p.m. in the afternoon continuously painting so I have a lot of orders um, especially kois because they said that kois are really lucky so kois and some abstracts <laughs> some abstracts um, our house is like a uh, a gallery because I have a lot of paintings there I I did I think all in all is like from the, the canvas with the the gallery uh, with the I mean with the acrylic and and oils I think I did a lot like more than 200 artworks but I don't really 
have a copy of it. Uh, it's just that I have a name, a watermark, but I don't really know where it is right now. Who's the, the person who I can remember some, but mostly I can't. So I have a lot of artworks that I can't remember. And then they will just tell me, oh, it is from you. And then I see from our house. I have an artwork from 2016, 2018, that was like years ago and it's just good to see that um, I'm doing it until now. Um, nowadays um, I get really busy with my, with my um, work, it's, it's chaotic. <laughs> As an ED nurse it's really time consuming and the time that you have in your day off is you just want to rest and Sometimes if you have a spare time, you do overtimes or NHS piece because you get an extra money if you want to travel. If I want to travel, I do extra. I don't get it from my salary because it's just in, not enough <laughs> with the bills. <laughs> Especially now that the cost of living is really high in the inflation rates. So you have to do an extra, extra jobs like, yeah, agency works like that. So actually, this uh, painting, I don't really do commissions in it right now, but because I was like getting all the things that I need. And yeah, I think I mostly have all the things that I need so I can really do, do some. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you what's the output. And I think I'm gonna just going to put it in a... Mm, um, what do you call that one? The, the fast pace. <laughs> the fast pace. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to show it to you, but I'm not going to talk. Um, I'm just going to show you the um, the final up. Because <laughs> I'm practicing because of the, the commission, that, the upcoming commission that I will do for a Louis Vuitton bag. So it's been a long time that I didn't do a um, commission for the bags. So... I, I need to refresh my skills and my techniques, especially with this um, leather paints. So, yeah, that's it. I'm gonna pick, guys. So, my technique is really simple doing the bag painting. I usually start with a um, base, um, like the acetone one, just to clean the bag and make it more like stiff so if you paint in there it's it's a nice contrast nice um leather stiff leather and then I, i'm putting the first coat which is the white one the white coat so i was i was not really thinking what to do in this bag i just really want to test the quality of the paint so i just saw i was like oh, what if i do another van gogh so they will be twinning with my wall painting <laughs> i really love van gogh by the way so so i just said okay because i memorized that one already and even though i don't look at the reference i already knew how to do a the artwork of van gogh um especially the starry starry night because this is my favorite one among the collection of van gogh paintings um, so I basically time myself here. I said I won't be doing this one for more than an hour. So I did finish it around 45 minutes. It's it's a really fast painting. I didn't really detail everything. So um, just to for me to see the quality of the paint that I will do for my commission. And it works actually. And Angelus is really nice paint, by the way. Um, a lot of uh, people recommend to me, a lot of an artist before recommends me with this Angelus one for the leather paints. And I tried to order it on Amazon, but there are some, but I really want to see it by myself. So I went to London to find a Angelus with, there is only one shop that they sell the Angelus one, which is the cast art cast art store in Piccadilly but in the Piccadilly um, main store there is no leather paint so I had to go to the Soho Street which is not really far from the main uh, cast art um, store it's just like around 10 minutes walk um, we just follow the Google map 
and in that store they will give you a map going to the other store just to buy the the leather paints and they will give you as well a like a stamp pad that if you will finish those stamps you will have a free canvas or free any items from the store so um, it was a really good deal for me because i got to see um more paints that i'm looking for like the oil paints that i want but i really want the van gogh oil paints it's just that they have a really small um, tube for the Van Gogh and I don't really want to go back and forth to London just to buy the paint so uh, I did buy other um, I think that's, that, was, that was Georgian and then I did buy the Liquitex one because that's my favorite acrylic because I still want to do a lot of um, paintings for the house and um, maybe painting for other people it really depends on the time that i have because i am really really busy with my work now as a nurse so so yeah in my spare time i will do this one and today i have a lot of energy because i drink a really <laughs> really strong coffee so until now at like 1 p.m i still have a lot of energy so here it goes almost done there Hello! <laughs> Tapos na sa wakas. Ito na siya. Finish product. Hindi na ako nag-isip. Ito. <laughs> Pag-ay sumunod ang aking, ano, see? Ito. Hindi na ako nag-isip kay para, ha? Same siya ng, ayan! O, oh, diba? <laughs> Twinning sila. Hindi <laughs> na ako nag-isip. Tingnan natin. Hold on. Hindi pa siya, hindi pa siya dry eh. Medyo basa pa siya. Baba ka nga. <laughs> Ayaw sumunod na ngayon. Ayaw niya sumunod. Ayaw. Ayaw sumunod. Uy, baba. Okay, baba ko. <laughs> Ayaw na siya. So, Hey go guys. Quick lang. So, in fairness, maganda naman pala talaga yung yung paint na Angelus. So, bukas ibabrush ko lang siya. Tapos, di ba? Bilis. Wait lang. Ayun na. Masyara na mataas ang vlog na to. Kaya, tapusin natin. So, tomorrow, ang gagawin ko is ibabarnish ko siya. Mabilisan lang kung hindi siya, hindi siya talaga tulad niya. Parang ano na siya. Mabilisan gawa lang. Pero it's okay. Kasi gabi na eh. So, ayun. 